十八人みたいなことですね。そうですねえっとそうですね。あの例えばあのデザインだとえっと本当にあのえっと十六世紀ですねナポレオン時代とか、うん、それ以前とかの、うん、えっと例えばコスチュームの、うん、えっと画集ですね。画集とかをいっぱい集めたりあと例えばえっと。飛行村田蓮司さんがあ確かドイツですね、うん、あのドイツに行かれた時にやっぱチェペリン、うんはい、あの飛行船の写真集を、うん、こんないっぱい<笑>箱いっぱい買ってきまして、うん、それが非常に役に立ちました。うんえー、so um, according to different aspects, for example, the design aspect,、um, the, the stage was set in the 16th century. And as for costumes,、uh, they constantly gather a lot of portraits from that time period. And as you mentioned earlier, Mr. Murata visited Germany and bought a stack load of like different、um, art books,、uh, which he、um, kind of got the inspirations from. Did you ever expect the success of Lack of Val to reach the level that it has reached in America and many other countries? It's by far one of the top anime shows on TV、mm-hmm. and DVDs.、Mm-hmm. こんなにアメリカでも世界各国でもラストエグザイルこんなに愛されるとはあの思っていましたか。それについて感想はいかがですか。あ、じゃあ逆に聞いていいですか。えっ、ー、と。There's a q u e s アメリカとか世界中でえっ、ー、とラストエグザイルはえっ、ー、といっぱい見ていただいたり愛されているんですか。So is it really loved among the fans? Oh yes, it's one of the top selling anime right now. 今一番売れているあのタイトルです。DVD にも感じても。一番最高に世界的に売れている。あ、ベリベリハッピー。<笑>えっと日本にいるとそういうことが実はあまりわからない。So when he's in Japan, he never gets those kind of you know news um directly. So here he's really really surprised to actually you know experience that excitement among the fans. でゴンゾロえっと社長とかも。あまり教えてくれないんですね。<笑>ゴンゾ people don't really tell the directors directly how the success is, so he has no clue, you know. 初めて聞いた。<笑> first time hearing that it was just such a great success out of it, out of Japan. それは嬉しいですね。Very happy. And I personally enjoyed very much. 彼も個人的に大好きな作品で。Thank you. <笑>ありがとうございます。Uh, Can you explain in a few sentences how the teamwork with、uh, Shoji Murahama was the founding member of Gonzo Animation? So, the Gonzo Tachiaki Tata, Murahama-san, and the Kamukei, how did you do that? I was the founder of Gonzo, and I was the founder of Mr. Murahama and Mr. Maeda Mahiro, and what was the name? Mr. Shinji Higuchi. ミスター、えっと、馬之助飯田馬之助飯田えっとあとミスター、えっと、広瀬山口一二三四あとは一人森さんかな、えっと、あとは、えっと、ミスター森の今六名でしょそうですね、うん、えっと六名がえっとガイナックスってわかりますかスタジオガイナックス Are you familiar with the production ガイナックス Yes. うん yes. まあ、ミスター前田たちがそこにいて、えー、とその人たちが、えー、と別に作った会社だと思うんですね、はいえー、と立ち上げたのが要するに、えー、と仕事場として作ったって聞きましたそれ,でそれが最初にあって、えー、と僕は、えー、とサバリン、えー、と6ですかサバリン6の時に、えー、とアオル6号をやる時にえっ、ー、とミスター前田がディレクター、うん、で僕はその、えー、とお手伝い、はいあのえー、とサブディレクターって言った演出ってサブディレクターでいいのサブディレクターで呼ばれましたそれが一番最初です。So to give a little background of how Gonzo started off with,、uh, I started with six members,、uh, Mr. Murahama, Mr. Maeda, Mr. Higuchi, Mr. Ida, Mr. Yamaguchi, and Mr. Mori. And basically they were actually part of Gainax. And、um, it was, they just had, had a little office themselves. So that's the very foundation of Gonzo. And they, later on, it kind of branched off into a completely different production. But basically, it started off with the six members. And、um, when Blue Number, Suffering Number Six、um, 
project came about, uh, Mr. Maeda was a director, and Mr. Chikira was called in to become the subdirector, and that's how he started off with the, the Gonzo production. Many of the series you have directed and storyboarded don't have that common Bangham style of action and to have depth behind it. Such a show like Clan